everybody, my name is Sarah and today I'm going to be showing you my new doll, her accessories, and some DIY crafts you can do. Okay, so this is my new doll, Emma. Uh, here's her little hair band, headband, and here is her shoes. Her I didn't get to see the hair bands. Oh, I'm sorry. Here's her hair band. Can you see it now? Yes. Okay. Okay, and um, I she also has these little spatulas she can actually hold on to. That's why that's there. And let's see. Did I forget the other stuff? Oh, no, I think it's probably in here. Just a second, guys. Or maybe it's not. Did you bring my tights? Tights? They're not in my house. Okay, never mind. I'll talk about this later. Okay, um, I didn't bring it. Apparently, I didn't bring her a little apron. I thought I did. How dare you? I know. How dare? Pause. Just put a pause. But let me make sure this Whoa. is actually plain. Yeah. Plain. Okay, everybody. Uh, I did find her apron. Sorry about that. Uh, I found her apron. It's right here, and her little spatulas go in this pocket like that. Uh, I think that's all that. Um, I brought for you today for her new stuff anyways and now show her some CD cases well, okay now some DIY stuff I have made these little CD cases all by myself uh, you'll probably need uh, here's the things you'll need uh, you can look my uh, I don't think I have a video done yet I'm gonna make one right after this though uh, here's an invisible sister little thing um, it is, I never saw that. This is a little CD case with a little CD in it. I've opened the top, and it's um, just wrapped around with tape. You can print these offline. Uh, I don't have a video. I don't know if I will make a video, actually. I don't know if I'll have time. Probably not. But anyways, here's my... Little CD case. Oh yeah, and um, here's some little things that are really cool. There, are, this is Truvia little sweetener, and it fits in their hand just like really good, like right here. See, and then uh, this is the salt and pepper packet. They just come from restaurants. They're really cute. And ooh, there's one more thing I should show you. Just a moment. Okay, so these are little bottles, little candy bottles, and um, I've cut these little straws down, Oops. and I can just stick them in right here. That one's a little tall, actually. That one is too. Um, let me find a shorter straw. Here's a shorter straw. This one might be almost too short. That's okay. I just open that up, stick it in. Perfect size. Uh, if you don't have those, you can wrap them around cardboard or toilet paper, and it'll be fine. Oh, and here's another DIY craft you can do. You can grab these little cupcake little liners, and they work perfect. You can pick them up for like a dollar at the Dollar Tree, and they work for little baking ones. And if you just want to, if you want to make plates, here's a really good idea. Take cupcake liners like this, a pretty cupcake liner, cut around the bottom about quarter to a half an inch up and then you have your little bowl plate you can also use the little bitty cupcake liners for bowls and you can just use I don't know what you could use for bowls you could use the same thing and just cut it up higher that would work perfect okay now oh here now here's another cool thing you can use little stuffed animals as their pets. This is a wolf, but and this is the actual My Life is Doll thing. Uh, we can't see the face of it. Mm. Um, this Thanks. is one. Oh, guinea pig. That's a guinea pig, and this one is just a regular Aurora one, and it works perfectly. Uh, I've got five Aurora ones. Oh, and. I'm dropping stuff. Uh, little Barbie hairbrushes work great for them because, as you can see, they fit in her hand perfectly. And she can almost reach it back to brush it anyways. All by herself. 
and they work perfectly. They're hard plastic, so they won't hurt you. Or that. this is just a little uh, pony brush, my little pony brush, I think. It doesn't fit quite as well, but and this one looks a little better. So they do look like Barbie brushes, you can tell. Oh, and sorry, and my grandma uh, made some clothes. She made one for my cousin, which is filming. Her name's Kate Martin. I'm Sarah Rayer. But anyways. Yeah. Yeah. Here is um, a shirt. Her little shirt. Shirt with crochet around the edges. Um, here's her little pants with crochet around the hair and here. You can't really see that. It's really light, but it's really cute. And I think that's it. Sorry. Uh, don't tell me shoe at me. Hey, Kate, say hi real while I kind of put this stuff up. Say hi. Hi. No, you're ah! all, Oh, my. That was crazy. Here, say hi. Hi. Uh, talk a little while I do some other stuff. Or show uh, something. Oh, show her the scarf I made. Um, this is her scarf she made. Scoot back. It's really long. Oh, um, hey, before I forget, here's a little cell phone. I just cut it out of a little card, so it's really cute. And, um, let's get back to the scarf. And it fits perfectly around her neck. I made thinner ones, by the way. Yeah. She made thinner oh, ones. Oh, here's a thinner one. Okay. Perfect. There's a thinner one. It's Okay, here's a blue one. The other one's pink. Um, it goes around like this. And you can tie it different ways. I, I make different scarves. I've made a bunch of pillowcases. And I've made just a bunch of stuff. All you need is a sewing machine, a sewing machine and a serger. And if you want to make pillows without a change of pillowcase, all you'll need is stuffing. Okay, uh, come over here, Kate. Come over here and see me. Okay, getting back to it. Okay, we're going to say bye.